Hi, this is Helen Nash from Show Face Makeup and today I'm going to show you how to highlight and contour your face, how to shape your eyebrows and how to apply eyeliner. Start off by applying primer to clean skin. I'm using Skin Flash Primer from Dior. Apply it from the middle of the face, brushing outwards. This primer is great to use because it instantly brightens and evens out the skin's complexion and texture. Once the primer has set to the skin, cover up any red areas with a green tinted concealer. And cover any dark areas, like under the eyes, with an orange tinted concealer. Next, lightly apply the foundation that matches your own skin tone. Then with a concealer or foundation that is a few shades lighter than your own skin tone, apply to the highlighted areas, which will be the forehead, under the eyes and on the top of the cheeks, down the sides of the nose, on your brow bone, on your chin and on your cupid's bow. For the contouring part, you want a tone that is a few shades darker than your own skin tone. And here you apply this to the hollows of the cheek, under the neck, down the sides of the nose, on the temples, and a little on the side of the forehead. And now you'll just need to blend this in with a soft, flat brush using small circular motions and set with powder. Now to add to the contouring, I'm just going to add a little bit more dark powder to the areas. If you have a thin nose but it's slightly bigger down the bottom, you will not need to contour down the sides of the nose so much. I'm also going to enhance the highlighted areas even more by applying some highlighting powder. You can also add a nice peach colour to the cheeks to finish off. Where your eyebrows begin, try to avoid applying any harsh lines. Use soft strokes with your product. This will make your eyebrows look more natural. You can measure where your eyebrows should end by placing your brush so it aligns to the side of your nostril to the edge of your eye. And make a small mark with your product. I'm using eyeshadow and a pencil to fill in the brows. You can measure where your arch should start by aligning the brush from your nostril to the edge of your iris and you can locate where your eyebrow should start by aligning your brush from the side of your nose straight up. To make your eyebrows look a bit neater, use some concealer under the brow to give them a nicer shape and then set the concealer with some powder. When applying eyeliner, you need to use your lash line as a guideline. I'm using a tissue to get a nice straight line. Then with my super liner, I'm just going to make a small mark of how high I want my flick to be. Using a gel eyeliner, I will then join the dot to the lid and start to apply my eyeliner from the middle of the lid first, getting slightly thicker as I get to the end of my flick. Apply a thin line to the centre of the eye to join it all up. To finish off the look, I'm just going to add a neutral colour to the lips. And this is your finished look. 